David DePop, accused of attacking House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's husband Paul Pelosi at their San Francisco home in October, told police that he also planned to target a list of other public figures, including actor Tom Hanks, Hunter Biden, and California Governor Gavin Newsom. The revelation came at a preliminary hearing for DePop on Thursday. According to the Associated Press, Lt. Carla Hurley testified that in interviewing with Pop for an hour after he was apprehended at the Pelosi's home, he told of other people he wanted to pursue. According to court records, DePop told authorities that in his break-in at the Pelosi home on October 28, he was searching for the House Speaker, but she was in Washington at the time. DePop has pleaded not guilty to a series of federal and state charges, including attempted kidnapping of a federal officer or employee and assault of an immediate family member of a federal official. It was not clear why DePop wanted to target the other public figures, but he reportedly had embraced conspiracy theories. According to Hurley, DePop told her during the interview, There is evil in Washington, what they did went so far beyond the campaign. Paul Pelosi suffered serious head injuries and wounds to his hand after DePop struck him with a hammer, police said. The Pelosi's were in Washington on Thursday for an unveiling of Nancy Pelosi's official portrait. Earlier this month, Paul Pelosi made his first public appearance since the attack, attending Kennedy Center honors ceremonies with his wife. One of Pelosi's children, Christine Pelosi, was present at the hearing in San Francisco Superior Court. Prosecutors also played Paul Pelosi's 911 call and played video of the attack that was captured by body cameras. According to the Associated Press, San Francisco police officer Kyle Cagney told the court that when he and other officers arrived, DePop and Pelosi were holding the hammer. 